Hey, welcome back to KNQ Visual Productions. I'm Karthik, your host, and today in this video, we are gonna learn how to bend watch straps. So, as a VFX artist, as a product animator, what I have uh, faced is to bend watch straps. And today in this video, I'm gonna teach you how I do. So, this is going to be my uh, process on how to bend straps. So, without further ado, let's get in the video. So, first of all, this is a watch I'm gonna use. So, this is a uh, very nice, very polished 3D model of a smartwatch. So first of all, what I do is, this is my first step. I I duplicate the straps, uh, that, uh, that is the straps, uh, including the buckles, everything. I just duplicate it and keep it aside because if we need it, we can use it for later. Then I add a curve and that curve is not an ordinary curve. It's going to be a circular curve. And I place the curve uh, under the watch. Uh, something like this which 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 will look like a strap so something like this then what we need is we need the origin point of the straps to be at the end so what I do is I just I will select some vertices from the uh, end point and I do cursor to select it then I will go to object set origin origin to 3d cursor so I will get the 3d uh, cursor at the edge of the or, or at the end of the strap so I, I will do the same process for for the uh, second strap. By selecting the strap, I will go to the modifier. I will use the curve modifier. And for the curve object, I will select the curve which I created, of course. Then for the deform axis, uh, I will just change it. So then I change the deform axis. Uh, to Z axis and if your strap don't bend in the way uh, which which I bend it then that's because your strap might not have uh, enough enough subdivisions so all you need to do is add more loops so that it, it will have enough subdivisions to bend itself so again I will change the deform axis to minus Y I mean just 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 play with the axis once you get the perfect axis just uh, choose it now I will place a watch uh, according to my wish so I'll just scale it up and make it fit where it should or where it is supposed to be fit in the smartwatch then I will use the second curve and I will place the strap on the on the place where it's supposed to be placed And then I will do the same process once again. First of all, what I do is I will uh, like make the origin point at the end. So the, the, the same process, I will select some vertices at the end, then cursor to selected. I will go to the op object set origin and origin to 3d cursor so once i get the 3d cursor at the end point of the strap what i do is just go to the modifier again add curve for the curve object i will select the curve then for the deform axis i will select the minus one then the same process i will just scale it up and um, match the position or where it where the strap supposed to be fit something like this then i will place all the buckles and all those mechanism or you know that hinges and hooks i'll place that to the strap so yes that's it now all i need to do is just adjust the size rotation and the position so from now this video is going to be a time lapse or or uh, i'll just put a song so that you won't get bored so yeah i will meet once uh, after i complete this tutorial
So yeah, that's it guys, uh, this video was not a step by step tutorial because this video is uh, like aiming for those people who who are into Blender who, who knows 
how to use Blender and its modifiers. So this video is not at all a beginner friendly tutorial and I hope this video helped you and I think for like this video will work even for beginners. I don't know uh, but if, if it worked please subscribe and hit the like button because that that's what I mean if you don't hit the like button my video won't uh, you know reach the algorithm so please like the video you are not going to lose anything just like the video and, and if you like even if you don't subscribe no problem please like the video if you love this video and um, that will be great great help for me because I'm just a small youtuber I'm just trying my level best to grow and that's it guys once again you're watching K and Kvishal Productions I'm Karthik and I'm signing off see you in the next video until then take care Thank you.